This already came mix match, so it's a red top and then floral in the jungle type of bottoms. And it has like a hint of a yellow flower right there. So, I mean, you could really match it with like whatever you wanted to. I think this is like the second one out of like at least three, maybe more in this haul that I'm going to show you. The top fit perfectly. It was a little bit like barely covering me, but honestly, that's kind of how I like my bikinis. It is really, really cheeky in the bottoms, almost like a thong, but like not quite. It's like, it's pretty close though. So I don't know if you're feeling scandalous. This again is one of my top favorite styles of a swimsuit because it has the mesh on the top and then the seashell which covers your nipple and the bottoms are super comfortable and I think they could technically be reversible. We're gonna start off with this swimsuit right here. It's bright orange, but it also has other colors like in the stitching, which I thought was super cute. It's a two piece. And what I did with the top was I actually strapped it in the front because that made me feel like it was a little bit more secure on my body. Again, it's totally up to preference, however you like it. And keep in mind that all these swimsuits do have different colors you can get them in. This swimsuit is definitely one of my favorites. Again, it's sort of like the speedo type of feel and it looks like cotton candy, which I thought was really funny. <laughs> it's sort of like a high waisted bottom which is the strappies on the sides of your like hips. But I thought it was cute and I liked it a lot. It might give you some weird tan lines in the back, but that's okay. This one right here, it's sort of like a mermaid top. It's actually strapless, but it comes with the straps, which I think is really great because I don't like strapless bikinis. I can't do it because I just can't. It'll, it'll fall down. So you can easily strap on the top like so. And then again, it comes in other colors. The bottoms I thought were so cute. They remind me of LA or Florida or something. Just the palm trees and everything. This was also one of my faves just because the style and how it kind of strapped on my body. It was a little bit weird at first when I tried it on, but then I just got used to it. So it almost looks reversible. I don't know if it's reversible or not, to be honest. Like, I think it could be, but yeah, it says love top melon. Don't know what that means, don't really care. I just like the way that it fits. So moving along. This one, again, one of the most comfortable in the entire lot, fits like a Speedo. Definitely not the most supportive thing, but I feel like I'm gonna wear this when I tan just because it's loose on my body. It is really, really cheeky in the bottoms, almost like a thong, but like not quite. It's like, it's pretty close though. So I don't know if you're feeling scandalous, there's absolutely no support in the top though, but it still somehow manages to like keep my top strapped in, you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, the way they made it was really smart. I don't know, but I like this it. first bikini right here. I love the color of it has the braided little straps on the bottom and it also has adjustable little things on the back of the top. So you can adjust it to be as tight or as loose as you want it to be, which is great. I have this gray swimsuit. I believe it is the only gray swimsuit that I picked out for this haul. So a really basic color swimsuit that you could wear for any occasion. And what I really, really love about the swimsuit is the fact that you can actually crisscross the straps in the front, which I love to do. One of my favorite swimsuits ever is an orange one that I did in a previous haul and that is because of the fact that you can crisscross them. If I did not do that, this swimsuit would probably be a little bit small, but that keeps my top supported on my body. So I love that and I just think that it adds a little bit of oomph to the swimsuit and makes it a little bit more stylish. This next bikini is probably my favorite out of the entire haul. It is a fishnet black two-piece with the sequiny rose picture that covers your nipple, which is really cool. And it also has this that wraps around your stomach. So it makes it look a little bit different, kind of stylish. So I really, really liked this one. Also the bottoms, it's kind of like a thong low key, but super, super cute for the beach. This first swimsuit is tie dye and I love it so much because it's rainbow. Also because you can adjust the back of the top as tight or as loose as you'd like it to be. This next one I thought was really fun. It's purple. And when I first got the top, I was really confused because I was like, okay, I don't have three boobs. Like what? But this is for the back, this back part. And then the bottoms also match the top perfectly. I don't know what it's supposed to be, maybe like a sun or something, but I like the little design and I like that it is a little bit different and you have like this triangle back. This next bikini is a tie-dye one. Again, another rainbow tie-dye. I think this is like the second one out of like at least three, maybe more in this haul that I'm going to show you. The top fit perfectly. It was a little bit like barely covering me, but honestly, that's kind of how I like my bikinis because I don't wear padded bikinis. This again is one of my top favorite styles 
styles of a swimsuit because it has the mesh on the top and then the seashell which covers your nipple and the bottoms are super comfortable and I think they could technically be reversible. I'm gonna start off with this first one just because it's the first one I tried on earlier when I was filming these clips. It's like an orange mandarin sort of color I would say. Super stretchy material. What I really like about this bikini is that there's no clasp on the back of the top so it just makes it a lot more comfortable. It has sort of a bandeau look so you could almost get away with wearing this like under a tank top and it not looking like a bikini but there is a little bit of under boob you just can't tell unless you're standing like directly under the person wearing it this one is just like that song she wore an itsy bitsy teeny weeny yellow oh it just kidding it's strapless but again it stays up really nice and i liked how you tied it in the middle because it just made it a little bit cuter in my opinion and the bottoms are adjustable on the sides which i really appreciate because sometimes these kind of bottoms don't fit the best first bikini is a really cute cheetah leopard looking print and the bottoms are kind of skimpy but they still cover you pretty well and the top is really really adjustable which i like because i feel like even if you are a certain size it may not fit everyone the same you can adjust it with these little straps or the way that you tie it in the back and so i feel like this is just something a little bit different than a plain red swimsuit or a plain blue swimsuit etc so i like it plus you can always mix and match this next bikini is actually a one piece which i don't normally get too often but i felt like this was just the typical red lifeguard looking thing and and I feel like the way it fits is kind of sexy. It's not just like a normal one piece that covers everything. I just thought it would be kind of like a fun thing to throw in here as well. This already came mix match. So it's a red top and then floral in the jungle type of bottoms. And it has like a hint of a yellow flower right there. So, I mean, you could really match it with like whatever you wanted to. The sides even have this little strip, which makes it a little bit different and kind of stand out. So I like that one a lot. Again, this is like a total rave swimsuit. It's a two piece bedazzled glitter sequiny pink and it has a little line in the bottoms to make them cheeky just like the green ones I showed you so they already know what's good and also when you tie it on the sides or the top it has the little gold ends which I think make it a little bit more bougie this next bikini is sexy AF it's snakeskin looking but in red nothing to tie on the bottom and then the top what I like to do sometimes is actually strap it in the front I'll probably wear it either way just depending on my mood but if you like the option to be able to do that then this is definitely a a great pick because the straps are adjustable. Next bikini is kind of like a greenish bluish color. Kind of fits like a bandeau but it's super supportive and then the bottoms are the same exact color. Very very simple so if you are more into the simple not so patterned style like the first two that I just showed you then this is definitely the way to go. This next bikini not gonna lie didn't fit me as well as I would have liked it to. Low key didn't cover me that much all the way so I strapped it in the front which is a life hack in case you guys were wondering and I also tied it right here because it was a little bit just like loose fitting. Definitely Ariel mermaid vibes. And the bottoms, just very simple. They match. This next bikini, I also did a photo shoot in and it's blue with different patterns on it. But I feel like this could be reversible. Like, I don't know if it's intended to be, but look at the color if you flip it that way. And same with the bottoms. This is literally two different bikinis in one. So yeah, I love this one. Blue's also my favorite and color. And then last but not least, I'm not typically a fan of orange, but because it was velvet, I felt like it honestly looked really good. And the top was really supportive when it was wet surprisingly just because of the velvet fabric like it stuck to my chest more which was nice because you definitely don't have to worry about this coming off once you're in the water and the straps were yet again adjustable and I feel like velvet is almost kind of like lingerie or rave vibes like think about it with fishnets and stuff this doesn't even really look like a bikini 